Hey everyone, Chris here again from Critters Rehatched, and I'm going to do another update with you guys for my Critters memorabilia collection. And today is going to be about nothing but my Critters memorabilia t-shirts, my t-shirt collection that I have. All my t-shirts, Critters related, and I have quite a bit of them, and a lot of them are, are like, um, custom made. So I just, you know, I know a guy um, who runs a t-shirt business, and I just asked him if he could do a few designs for me, and he did. So I got quite a bit of those from him. Um, uh, others are just found going to a convention, um, and there's actually a couple of, of t-shirts that are officially released from through other companies. Um, but I'll talk about some of those, and I'll talk about where I got them from, and, and all that stuff. So, the first one here, I'm not, there's a no in particular order, just the order that I grabbed them in. Uh, we have the, it's like the B poster for the first Critters movie, it's like a, it's like a different kind of poster for it. Uh, with the family on the stairs, and it says, Critters, they bite. This one was done through Fast Custom Shirts. Um, you can go to their website, fastcustomshirts.com. There's different there's different kinds on there. Uh, this just happens to be the one that I like the most, and you can get that one from him as well if you'd like. Fastcustomshirts.com. This one is also from Fast Custom Shirts, and this is the cover art for the Critters Four. I always like this one. That's kind of cool. These are all done black and white, by the way. So. Uh, the shirts are actually really comfortable too, but um, they only cost ten dollars. Uh, both of those from Fast Custom, Sh Custom Shirts were ten dollars. Uh, this one also came from Fast Custom Shirts, and this one is for Critters Two, the main course, and this one being the um, the alternate cover art besides the critter ball rolling around. This is the the other version of it, and this one's from Fast Custom Shirts. It only cost ten dollars as well. Um, this one, let's go through the Fast Custom Shirts again. The next Fast Custom Shirts that I got is the, uh, I asked him if he would do some type of variant, uh, and I showed him the, uh, a certain poster that's like a Mandarin poster, I don't know where the poster comes from, but, um, it's like Region 7 or something like that, and I like the cover art too, and I asked him if he could do something on that, and, um, and this is what he came up with, so he got that for me. This one's kind of cool, it's just the critter bursting through the shirt, I thought that was really cool. Like I said, ten dollars, pretty cheap. And the last one that I got from Fast Custom Shirts is this, just the very um, original cover art, pretty much, with the critter standing there with critters above it that says they bite. And so, guys, head over to FastCustomShirts.com. Help this guy out. He's a really cool guy. Um, you know, I'm friends with him and stuff, and I know him, and he does a really good job. He gets your shirts to you pretty quickly. And uh, they're only ten dollars, so head to your web, head to the website fastcustomshirts.com, and uh, pick up some uh, critters merchandise. The next shirt that I have here, I don't know what company made it. Um, I'm pretty sure it's just a fan a fan made shirt, um, but like a custom made shirt that people sell at conventions. Uh, I went to a convention and there was a vendor there that had a bunch of just random T-shirts and stuff, and he had this one up. And this was very similar to the one from Fast Custom Shirts, except for the fact that the critter is a little bit bigger, and the critters down at the bottom at the bottom is written in color. And uh, I thought this was really cool. I just had to pick it up. So um, the next one here, this one's my favorite shirt of all of them that I have. And this one I also uh, found at a convention. Uh, this was also just fan made, and I I was just looking through this guy's shirts, and I saw this one, and I just immediately grabbed it. It was the only size they had. Uh, only one they had, and this is Critters, and it has the Critters written down at the bottom there, and um, this one has color for everything. It's It's got the color for the Critter, it's got the color for the background, and the Critters is written in red. So I always thought this was kind of cool, and I just love the, the image there, and um, it's just really, really cool. This is my favorite shirt that I've found so far of the series. Now there is another shirt that I know of. There's a shirt that has the artwork from the Critters Mondo poster on it, and it is done by, um, uh, I think Mondo might have done the shirt too, but there's also another generic, or not a generic, another um, officially type shirt made, it's done by Fright Rags, and it has like a bunch of critters starting right here, smaller, and it like kind of rolls into another big one as they attack. Um, and that's a really cool shirt too. I don't own any of those. Every time I go to a convention and I see uh, Fright Rags has a vending table up, um, they always say that they just didn't bring the shirts with them this time or that they didn't 
have enough to bring with them for the critters, and they just they're at they're back at the store and like that, and it's done that every single time. So I just haven't been lucky on finding the Fright Rags Critters T-shirt yet, um, or the Mondo version shirt either. But I'm sure I will eventually. But uh, thanks guys for watching my uh, T-shirt collection. I know it wasn't much, and I didn't really have much to say about them, but um, there's really not much to say about clothes. So. Uh, just head over to fastcustomshirts.com and pick up some Critters merchandise, uh, help the guy out, and uh, sport some Critter stuff. Thanks guys for watching, and I'll see you again with another update.